my channel is Shaq so I'm back with another video review and here we have December 2014 the last one of 14 which is the anniversary it's a really really big box but same thing on all the look crate boxes this all black has the logo on the top logo on the sides the front on the back has a little QR code and then your information and shipping is on the bottom. So let's get this open. I wasn't really impressed with this one, other than the Funko figure. I'm all about these. I thought this was very, very, very cool. The Joker Batman Batman. The Joker is dressed up as Batman, which is very, very, very cool. And it is a Loot Crate exclusive. It says the Joker, Batman, Batman. So that's the Joker on the back. It's number 65. Pretty much the same packaging on all the Funko figures. Has the character and then the background and then the number and then the character name on, I guess, the left side. Then the window is on the right side with the number like the top of the head and then the name and on the top has the logo and then top of the head again and on the back has the side of the figure and then the background and then whatever else comes in the wave or in the series or whatever and then the bottom has the code but there's the first item second item is a pair of grit socks that we don't wear weird socks maybe for like winter or something but there's some grit socks I have the Deadpool ones also I don't really wear them so it's kind of a waste but here's the Tetris uh, sticker set comes with uh, 150 I mean 147 tre Tetraminos guess what these little shapes are called This is very, very cool. Too bad these aren't magnets. I would have preferred these to be magnets. That would, that would have been very, very cool for this, but oh well. Here is a air freshener, which is Captain America. Well, Avengers assemble. Put the camera down. So there's that, which is a vanilla scented. I won't be using that because I have black ice for my car. A, a half or three fourths of a candy cane. A lot of people's their candy cane broke, but mine didn't for some reason. So I think that's pretty cool. Then we have one of these Mighty Waltz, which is Simpsons. Has a whole crap load of the Simpsons characters on here. Can't even really name them all. So many. It has coupons for ordering more Mighty Wallets, which are pretty cool. This is made of paper. And the characters continue on the inside of the Wallets. I'm pretty sure there's no repeats, actually. No, there's not. I'm pretty sure if you unfolded this, it'd be one piece, but I don't know. So this is. Pretty mighty, no pun intended, but there's the wallets with some coupons in it. I gotta put this in here. There's that. What else is in here? There's a Ghostbusters little door hanger, and it says, Come on in, you ugly little, st uh, little spud. So, Slimer. And on the back, it says, Warning, Ghost Busting in Progress. That shows slime. Looks like this is a Lucre exclusive, which is okay. What else do we have? We have the Loot Crate little thing. It has the word art, the phone form, uh, Homer Simpson, and then Grit. I think that's Grit. Yep. Grit. Um, 
Batman, and then Slimer. And they're all made out of words that are associated with whatever movie or comic they're in. <laughs> and the Groot one's just made out of I am Groot or Groot or I am. So that's pretty freaking cool. I'd definitely wear a shirt like that. See, so Groot's, I am Groot, Groot, I am Groot's, I am Groot's. It's a bunch. That's pretty cool. Then we have something for Crunchyroll. This is pretty cool. I think this is the last thing other than the button. I haven't seen that yet. Exclusive Loot Crates comic for Batman Endgame. This is number 36. The Batman's getting punched by, I'm assuming, the Joker. You get a free digital copy. Comes in a little nice backing. And the button, which I just found, it is gold. And it says Loot Crate Anniversary, December 2014, which is pretty cool. And of course, the actual box looks like it's Batman's lair or something. But anyways, I'm pretty sure I fold this like this. Like so. I don't know how it goes, but there it is. It's like a little cave of some sort. There's a little sad T-Rex or something. It looks like Batman, Green Lantern, and Superman or The Flash. I don't know, but it's pretty cool. A lot of cave work. Looks like bats, some glowing eyes, some little support beams, some rock, more rocks, more support beams. Then it looks like here's the Joker on the screen. I'm assuming this opens up. Yep. This opens up to form a ramp or something. I don't want to break the box. I never really display these. I just keep the box. But there you go, guys. We got the pop, uh, pop vinyl figure. We got the uh, Crunchy Roll. Got the Loot Crate uh, booklet. Ghostbusters little door thing. Mighty Wallets. Air Freshener. Candy Cane. Tetris. Tetraminos. The grit socks and the loot crate button. I'm only going to be getting the loot crate if they have a Funko figure or if they have a theme that I really like. This one I really don't like other than the Funko figure. But I would have to say that most of the loot crate um, crates were pretty okay except for uh, this one. I prefer when they have the Funko figures. It like, feels like it's worth the money. I know it's supposed to be random, but sometimes it just feels like they just got some merchandise from a store that didn't sell, and they just threw it in there. And I feel like they're wasting a little bit of the um, actual crate amount on the box and the booklet. Because... I don't need air freshener. I already got my own. But if you guys like it, that's to each his own. So, anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I got more videos to come. Uh, probably gonna be skipping out on the rewind uh, loot crate, which is January. I'm gonna wait for February. So, don't look forward to a freaking loot crate from me from um, January. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for a lot more videos to come. All right, guys, later.